we gonna record this video or not? I'm not really feeling motivated to do that. Why do I have to do it anyway? I got something real good you're gonna like. Trust me. Something I'm gonna like, huh? Alright, fine. Let's go. <clears throat> I don't understand. I don't gotta do any of these videos. People don't wanna watch this shit. They're just gonna sit there and bitch all day. Shh. All right. Let's get started. Hey guys, too legit to quit here. He coaxed me into it. Yeah, I'm wearing a different shirt. So what? Let's move on to the clip. Counter jungling. That's what we're going to talk about today. Unfortunately, sometimes you're going to see people who just can't uh, hack it and they start getting a little upset because you have better map awareness than them. So in this clip, you're going to notice that I'm playing Zen and I see, hey, guess what? I'm stronger at level two. Power spike. So we're going to go and we're going to go hit up uh, Udir. Now in the process of hitting up Udir, you're going to see that his teammates are going to come and start trying to mess me up not a good idea. My teammates, on the other hand, are outstanding this game, and that's something you're not normally going to see because it's League of Legends, you know, and it's usually one for all and all for go away. Fuck you. So anyway, uh, yeah, we end up killing Odir, and then it just kind of becomes a shit show. Um, everyone decides to jump in, and you'll notice at the end there that Velkaz jumps over, exhausts the bard, and helps me. This motherfucker right here is my hero, and I drink to him. I love you, Velkaz. That's counter jungling in a nutshell. All right, guys, for this one, we're gonna talk about map awareness, uh, something that we all need to work on. Unfortunately, while I am in my sobriety, not at the moment, I am actually able to pay attention to the map and see what I need to do uh, because, you know, I'm not being a noob lord and failing to my team at every single second I possibly can. Um, so in this moment, I'm looking around the map and I notice, hey, you know what? I just finished my blue and the mid lane is pushed up and the top lane is pushed up. This is an absolutely great opportunity for me to go and find Udir. There he is. We end up popping him off and guess what? He gets a little frustrated. Yeah, there it is, right there at the end. So, this one's to you, Udir. Alright guys, so continuation of map awareness. Um, in this clip I noticed the top lane has three people up there. Well, what can we do within that time? We can go take some goddamn objectives, you know what I'm saying? Like, why are we gonna sit around and try and run upstairs, you know, and get smacked around by grandma because, you know, it's grandma, it's uncle, it's dad, it's mom, all of them are just gonna hit you a few times because you've been stupid. But in this case, you're gonna go and you're gonna clean your room. Take an objective, you know what I'm saying? Doing good things, and to that I'll drink. All right, guys, we're gonna talk about this fucking clip four more times because I can't say it right. Prepping for ganks, that's what we're getting at here. I'm getting more aggressive now, I hope you're ready, because now I'm gonna hit that stupid rapper twice. And then I'm gonna flash over the wall, I'm gonna hit Annie, she's gonna die, and we're all gonna go home and drink some fucking beer. Alright guys, sometimes shit's just gonna happen in the game and you can't really control it, whether it be bad teammates or just a fuck up in a play. So when this play, Azir tries to throw Annie against the wall, it doesn't work. Azir oh just ends up uh, fucking up completely. Yeah. I try and fix it by throwing Annie backwards, but Dangerous Game saves her because when you kill someone, you get some health and mana back. The best part about it is he knows he messed up. I fucked that up. You know, he's the reason I drink. I can't believe I missed Shit's that. just gonna happen. Thanks. Speaking of shit happening, guys, uh, sometimes Vayne thinks she's gonna be some kind of badass where Poppy's gonna come in, she's going to knock her into the wall, hit her up with her all, and then I'm going to knock her up with my Q, and that's gonna be a deleted Vayne. Vayne, this one's to you. Alright, guys, so what you're going to do, you know, throughout most of the game is secure objectives. You're a jungler. The main thing you need to be doing is making sure that you are. Either one, jumping a lane, two, making sure that you're prepping for a gank, or three, taking some motherfucking objectives. Because if you're not doing that and you're just sitting there killing raptors all day, you are a worthless piece of trash. I am a worthless piece of trash, but sometimes I can be useful. Like in this clip where I'm actually going and killing dragon because I notice that there is people sitting in top lane. Fantastic! Why not go take some objectives? Or what about when I actually go into, you know, the Baron Pit where the Rift Herald is? Fantastic! You know why? Because it's taking objectives, and objectives are cool. 
Object, object, object. Object is a cool. I am really drinking. All right, guys, this has been five things to remember when playing jungle. We talked about counter jungling, map awareness, prepping for ganks. Sometimes things happen and securing objectives. I know that I'm kind of a shitlord at this game, and the only thing I'm really good at is drinking and sometimes getting some decent plays. But guess what? Sergeant Soldier and I are here to make sure we bring you all the entertaining facts, comedy, and whatever else bullshit we can do. So from me to you, and you to him, and him to me, and me to you, I'm going to keep drinking and peace the fuck out. By the way, there will be some fun stuff at the end of the video. I'm not looking forward to it. Bye-bye! Alright guys, so this time we're going to talk about prepping for a gank. And a good way to do that is you want to know your abilities for your character. Um, for Zin Shao... Zin Zhao? Zin Zhao. Zin Zhao! Do it again. Zin Zhao, go fuck yourself. That's got to go in the clip. <laughs> anyway, he, uh... Cut the video. <laughs> Just cut it. <laughs> Alright. And it cut. Alright, here we go again! Let's play Woo! Again. <laughs> All right, for this video, we're going to talk about prepping for a gank. And when you're playing someone like me who's playing Zin, you're going to notice that you, your Q, has a third move. Damn it. <laughs> All right, guys. Here's the next goddamn clip where I keep fucking this one up. So here we go. We're talking about prepping for a gank, and I'm not going to mess it up. I'm going to hit that damn raptor three times, twice. Shit! <laughs> Alright guys, we're gonna talk about this fucking clip four more times because I can't say it right. Prepping for ganks, that's what we're getting at here. I'm getting more aggressive now, I hope you're ready.